Hello everybody, this is Christina with Tatter Rose Studios and my long awaited uh, video is now happening. Um, this is my flip through of my um, October Smashbook and um, this time instead of using the Kane Company Smashbook um, I noticed that every month they are really fat so I wanted to try and use um, it's just a three ring binder that I had chopped off at nine inches to make it a little bit smaller and so it's eight well, eight and a half by nine and um, or eleven by nine sorry and so um, this is what I came up with I I just covered the binding with my um, smash washi tape and then covered it with some gel medium. I used some black duct tape here for the to, to do the edge and then I did my really cute mustache um, duct tape which I absolutely love. So that's the cover. I didn't really do any big embellishments for the cover. Um, it's just um, way too bulky. So here we go. I don't want to make this video too long, but they always end up being long anyway. But here we go. This is the first little um, page. I just have a little acrylic piece here. Um, on the inside, you can see I just have some regular um, paper with some journaling on it. Um, and this I also covered with the, the clear gel medium just to give it some extra support and sealing. This is just um, a little piece here that just tells me what paper collection I used and um, yeah that's pretty much it. And this is just tells me where I bought it which is uh, my local scrapbook store. Um, this is just a large shipping tag with some journaling about um, this Smashbook and why I decided to make it um, in this binder style. And then here's the, the front page. It just says Smashbook, October, um, and it just says the beauty of life, and then just some little journaling there. And again, I found this cute um, mustache um, paper at Hobby Lobby. And um, it started with the last couple days of September because my September smash book just got way too full. So this is just day 26 of September, um, day 27 of September. It's so big I can't even get it all in the the camera. Um, here's day 27 of September. Oops, I'm going to end up losing my keyboard. Okay. Day 27, day 28 of September. My daughter um, playing in the van. She just likes to pretend like she's driving. And this is just a page that um, a lot of people on my Facebook group, Smashaholics, um, were doing. So I printed it out, my story, my life, and then I just answered these questions. Um, like my favorite author, um, best friends, um, favorite food, stuff like that. This is day 28 of September and my husband took a picture of this really cool rainbow when he was out working and um, so I just did a page on that. This is um, day 29 and this is where um, we took the whole family to the movies to see um, Hotel Transylvania. So this one's like an actual two page um, day here. This is a picture of them at the theater and then this is just some random pictures or tickets 
Um, this is the, some of the really cool paper in that collection. I love those. Um, I got this at the dollar, was it the dollar store? No, at Big Lots. This really cute flower pin that actually matches the smash washi tape. See, it just was really cute. And there's just a little piece of the Hotel Transylvania um, pictures from, actually from a McDonald's Happy Meal box. And this is the next day. I didn't really know what to do, so I just took some of my magazine clippings and just um, stuck it on here. These are just some new nails that I had stuck on, so um, I guess I just did a whole page about nails. And then here starts day one of October. So we did about our favorite, about our favorite, um, my favorite food. This was part of a challenge that we did on um, the Smashaholics group on Facebook. Every day we had to do um, a challenge page and then our, our own, oh no, I just did my own regular page too. So the challenge page was what's my favorite, one of my favorite foods, and I put brownies. And this is just a little clipping of a dictionary word. This is challenge. Um, this is act the actual day one stuff that we actually that I actually did. Um, we went and just me and my daughter took a walk and um, we were just around a whole bunch of fall leaves. We were just getting into the the new autumn season. So here's her just crunching on a whole bunch of crunchy leaves. Did some journaling. I taped this one down. Um, this one I um, painted with some gel medium because I wanted it kind of loose, but I didn't want it to get crackly and, and fall apart. So I painted it with gel medium to make it a little stiffer. Um, this one's under some tape too. That's day one. Day two, um, here is day two. It is some funny faces that me and my daughter um, were playing around. And then the day two of the challenge was um, what make, makes me happy. Um, and I had um, put here, out of my family, I love going on YouTube and um, finding new projects to do, meeting new people that have the same hobby. So it's all about um, YouTube and how I express my inspiration to others and how I get inspiration from others. Day three, it was um, a curriculum night for my daughter at her high school, Linwood High School. And this is just the schedule that we had to go by. Um, this is just a picture from her gym where we had our meeting and this is her um, her school mascot and logo. Um, this is just a window envelope that I recycled from the mail. I used that for a pocket. And um, this is just a little button that I found on Etsy, on an Etsy store. Um, I forget who sent that to me. I bought them a while ago. Um, and this is just another one of those bobby pins that has the matching polka dot design. Um, this is day, um, was it day, day three of the challenge. Um, this is supposed to be, um, what's the question? What would I want from my grandmother's house? So I had, I have two things in my home from each of my grandmothers. I have this chest that used to be in her, my grandmother's bedroom and she used to keep all her stuff in it. So now we have it and we keep stuff in it. And this is for my other grandmother. It's a um, small, small grandfather clock that we um, have up in our home. Day four, um, this just shows some things, just us playing around. Um, my daughter likes to make tents, so we have that. This is actually the challenge page. It was the silliest thing I did to impress someone, and I can't really think of any silly things I did to impress anybody. So um, I figured, well, that game where you blow on the tummy and make them laugh, that kind of impresses them. 
um, help making them a tent that they like to play in, you know, just things that make her happy. This is um, my day four. It's just um, a little image, stamped image that I copied. It's actually a, a digital stamp um, image that I colored with my Copic markers. Um, it's a little washi tape girl, as you can see. And um, these washi tapes are like so popular right now. And they're just so, come in so many different styles. It's just amazing. And um, so this is a little girl who loves washi tape. And she also came with these little sayings. Um, Once they fell in love with a roll of tape or got washi or roses are red, violets are blue, washi tape, I couldn't live without you. So, and these are just two new ones that I had um, found on, on Etsy.com. And here in this little pocket, these little pockets are from the Dollar Tree store. Um, just shows um, the little packages that I opened. So that's just all that is. Um, day five um, just shows that I got these little, those little um, today, tomorrow, Monday, you know, days of the week buttons, and um, and then the challenge was. Um, the autumn season, one of the favorite things. So my one of my favorite things was the the changing of the um, the leaves on the trees. And this is a picture of my daughter. She um, got a little tiny pumpkin. Um, and then this is another thing that I love. Um, um, it was about the autumn season and your favorite thing about spring. So this is my favorite thing about spring was the Tulip Festival. And my family and I went to the Tulip Festival. This is another um, autumn one for the little bush. The leaves are turning red. And here's some more pictures. They have some autumn trees that are turning yellow. And then here's some more spring ones of the Tulip Festival. And this is just a little envelope that my mother sent me um, has my address on it, my name, just just because. <laughs> that was a challenge one that was really hard for me. I didn't get a chance to finish it. Um, this is day, I am lost what day I'm on, day six. Um, this was a Saturday. My, my, um, one of my youngest daughters had a little thing um, at her school and she um, was in a drawing and she won a free smoothie. So that's what that is. This is just a flyer about um, the pancake breakfast and about um, the place where she won the free smoothie. On this side is just um, of my daughter. She got to play on the playground at the school and at the park. So um, she was excited about going to the school and having fun. Um, also, in the same day, my oldest daughter had a band, um, Extrava, Extravaganza, um, at her school, and we went there and had like a parents meeting and, and talked about um, the trips they're going to be taking this year and all their stuff. So their trip this year is to Walt Disney World, so that's why I have the Disney washi tape here and then um, this little saying from a thing I got in the mail. Um, about Disneyland, it says believe in magical vacations after all, year after year. I thought it was cute. The next day on day seven, um, I had my first Smash Book Club uh, meeting, and it was at my local library in this um, little group study room. And this is the book that I was working on, which is this book right here. And that's just about that. Um, this one is um, not quite finished. It's the day seven of the challenge, and it was funny things my kids have said. I have funny things that my kids have said, but I don't really have a picture for this page yet, so this one's kind of incomplete. But um, one of the funny things is when I ask my three-year-old, you are so pretty, or when I tell her, you are so pretty, the little thing that she says, she goes, I know, I am. <laughs> I just think it's cute. On day eight, um, when my 
son and my daughter came home from school um, after their homework they um, actually did not fight that day and they decided to play the game of Twister and um, they just had a lot of fun and it was really silly and so I thought that was a good thing to journal about. Um, the challenge for this day um, was trivia so I decided to do um, Disney trivia and um, I just used a lot of washi tape I used my little uh, Mickey um, hole punch and some glitter cardstock and just made a whole bunch of little Mickeys here um, one for each question and answer so this is just a cute little page to read um, this one again I um, was going to do day nine about um, my favorite fall or Halloween tradition which is usually going to pick pumpkins but um, and, and carving them and everything but this year we didn't get to do that so I wasn't able to really do anything on that challenge um, this day nine was the start of spirit week for homecoming week for my my oldest daughter and this was injury day they had some really neat little um, themes at her school it was injury day and I have these little um, image printouts of little band-aids here and then down here and then I found a little teddy bear with a little broken arm and sling and cast so I thought that was cute and that's my daughter with her gauze bandage and red paint for blood and she has like a um, like a little metal cast here for her arm Again, this is another day that I was going to do a challenge and I wasn't able to find a picture to put there, which is weird because I take pictures all the time, but um, yeah, I couldn't. So I did my, my daily page, which was about baking, and um, I just cut this off the box and um, that I was baking that day. And these are just some letters. I glued these little chipboard pieces on. I used this little brad. It says, I love you. Um, and I made chocolate chip muffins. And on the other side, it just shows the other part of the box with the directions on it. Um, some little, um, like a heart um, plastic sticker there. These little, these are actually little brads of like um, chocolate chips or kisses. And um, I've had those forever. And I just now used them. I've had them for years. This is my daughter. She likes to lick the batter off the spatula when I'm done. Um, and this is just a large um, felt daisy that I put on there. And then there's the other part of the baking. And this is bacon. And then here's before they went in the oven and after they went in the oven. And then some more of the little chocolate chips here with some washi tape, some journaling pieces. On this day, um, we had a fun time playing again, and um, we um, played telephone. So I just have a little chipper where it says hello, it says hello friend, some journaling, and then just us playing together. Um, this is one of the challenge days, and it was. Um, it was about what would your title be for if it were, you were to make your own um, autobiography and right now um, in my life right now I just put God when am I going to get a break um, not only because I have four kids and I'm always busy with them and um, it's just getting a break to away from everything and and um, having time for myself um, having to work on these books and stuff. I, I usually do it while I'm watching TV late at night or I do it while I'm in the middle of playing with my daughter. So it's never really too much time to myself. <laughs> this is day 12. Um, this is just a day, we did not, nothing really significant happened. So I just did it about pizza. I found these little pizza, um, pizza party invitations that are shaped like pizzas and I found them for like a dollar 
And um, we went to Little Caesars, obviously. Here's the Little Caesars box. Um, and they had this huge picture of a pizza on the wall. As you can see, my daughter is standing right next to it, and it's really huge. So I thought it was cute, and so I did a page about that. Um, this was about um, picking out our costumes, what I like about October, and I put picking out our costumes. So here's my daughter. She picked out Minnie Mouse, and my other daughter picked out um, a phantom. This was another um, day 13, and um, this was about my three-year-old, her first haircut. Um, she has naturally curly hair, and it was super long, like down to her bottom, and um, she, it, it's so curly that it was tangled horrifically, like awful, and we couldn't even brush through it anymore, so we had to chop it all off, and here is a bag a Smashbook zip, Ziploc bag. It says little nuggets of happiness. So I have um, some little um, clippings of her hair there. And here's her. She was pretty much crying the whole time. She did not enjoy it at all. Um, at the, when we went to get her hair cut, um, Matt, the guy who was cutting her hair, um, gave her this cute little teddy bear to hold and um, it made her calm down you know quite a bit but she would not let it go when it was time to leave and Matt was so kind to let her keep it and um, when she comes goes back in January to bring back you know another toy in exchange so she was really happy with that so I took um, with this app on my um, phone um, one of those photo booth um, type pictures so I have a whole bunch of their dual teddy bear and then on here inside this little um, bag um, I have um, just some journaling a lot of journaling about it and um, a picture of her before she went back to get her hair cut she was totally happy and excited about it and then now she's sad when, when it comes time to getting it done so it was a happy sad day and then she was happy at the end she loves her short hair so it all turned out great. On the back is just a larger picture of her teddy bear and this is just the um, business card from the salon, some more journaling on the bottom and some journaling on top. Mom, you have to wait a minute. Um, and this is also the same day that my daughter went to her homecoming. So this is actually a picture of her when she got back because things were so hectic that day that I didn't even get a picture of her before she left. So this is when she got back. This is the dress that she picked out. Um, it was not a formal dance, so she just um, picked one of her dresses from her closet. It was really cute. And some journaling about it. Um, we also did some painting um, in our home, in the bathrooms and stuff, um, just because the painting was awful. So. so we just did that, and that's just some journaling about that and then some paint um, little chips there. Another day of a um, challenge I did not get a chance to do. Um, on this day this was a challenge for all of our favorite TV shows for um, the fall season. So these are just some of um, little clippings of some of my favorite TV shows. Um, on there and then this is just um, a fall lineup of the shows and what days are on. Um, this is also some journaling for day 14 which is my 12 year wedding anniversary. Um, my wedding theme was Cinderella so I have this little um, image that I had cut out printed and cut out from my computer and I stuck it on here of Cinderella because that was the theme of, our, of my wedding and some journaling and then the rest is just some cards that either people gave us so there's a this is a card from my mother and it's on the envelope that she sent us this is a card to me from my husband and the card he, the envelope it came with and then this is the card that I gave him and the envelope and bag that it came in um, this is the bag from the homework store and I just put this on here and just put best friends forever and this is just um, the envelope that it came in 
with a picture of um, the flowers. Tulips are my favorite. So these are the flowers I got for my anniversary. And it says together, always and forever. And the envelope. And that night for dinner, um, we had panda. So I just have this envelope in here, or this little bag in here. And um, a picture of a fortune cookie. And then um, I did some journaling about it. Here it just says fortune cookies. And then these are um, all the little fortunes from, from all six of us. Um, day 15's challenge was what are some fun facts about me? So I just have a picture of me here. Um, just some cute little um, em paper embellishments. And then on the inside, I have in this little envelope here is, um, if I can get it out. Oh my goodness. This is just um, some little fact, fun facts about me. And then you just put this back on here. Like that. So day 15 was um, a day we were supposed to go to court and we didn't um, get anything. It was canceled. So um, we, so my husband had the day off. We went and had lunch at Red Robin. And this is my favorite drink there, the freckled lemonade. And this is just the receipt. Um, and I also saved the little um, little paper tab that came around the napkins that holds the silverware. I put that on a clear little acrylic piece. And then on the back, it just has some words um, about that day. And then on this page, I cut out the menu part of my daughter's um, coloring menu, the kids menu. And um, there's a picture of her and my husband. Um, there's a picture, there's some journaling and there's a picture of her drinking her milk. Um, she had the little mandarin oranges and the little pizza. Um, on day 16, um, I took my daughter to McDonald's because she wanted to um, play on, the, on the, the play area where the big slides were. So this is just the, the Monopoly um, game piece here. This is a large um, fry box I use for a pocket. This is just her playing in the, the slide and this is just a picture of the whole play area. And then another thing uh, about this day was um, I just talked about um, one of my old favorite um, hot breakfast is uh, creme wheat. And I just talked about how my mother used to make it for me when I was a kid and how I used to love it. So it just has um, inside a picture and um, inside the little creme wheat packet. And then some journaling. And this is just another page of a challenge that I didn't get done. Have to wait. Um, this is um, another challenge day, and it was about um, what was your grocery list for this week? So I just put grocery. This is just um, on my regular grocery list paper that I have hanging on the fridge. A little um, bag with... Um, some more little um, journaling on it. And then this was day 17. Um, I just talked about how I love scrapbooking and smash booking. These are all my smash books that I've done. And then um, it just talks about, these are just pictures of all the pages that I've been working on in this book. Day 18 is about um, my daughter got a surprise in the mail. So here's a picture of her inside another recycled um, envelope from the mail. And um, I just have a little quote here. And then here's the picture of her with the package. And here's a picture of the item after it was in the package. Um, she loves watching um, anything Disney. And this is um, the farewell season of the Main Street Electrical Parade. 
and um, we used to have it and we just wore it out because all my children loved it and she was the last to get it so it was pretty worn out when she, when she got it so um, we found one for like two dollars online on Amazon and got it for her and she um, was really surprised that day so she was happy about that this is just the packaging that came in I just cut it down a little bit um, this day 19 um, we had um, some large trees in our backyard that were just being trimmed um, our landlord came out and um, had them come out and trim them because we didn't want them dead branches to fall while the kids were playing outside um, this is um, day 20 um, another package a package came um, with the Simple Stories album in it, and um, and um, I was just excited to get that, and that's pretty much all that's about. Sorry, this video is so long, it's already half an hour. Um, this is day 21. Um, we were um, having a girls' um, play time, and it was um, my youngest daughter, my two youngest daughters, my three-year-old likes to cover my head in every single barrette that she owns, which was really, she likes to do that all the time. And then another thing is that my, we like, we like to read stories. So that's what's, what picture is on this little tag. And some journaling. And then we also um, like to play board games. So this is just a picture of us playing one of my old favorite board games from when I was a teen. I still have it. It's called Sweet Valley High. And, um, all my kids love that game. Um, this is the next day. Um, what day is this? This is, um, it was a Monday. Day, day, um, day 22. And my daughter, um, you've probably seen in one of my other Smash books, she went to, to a school function that was a skating party. So this is just her second skating party for school. And it's kind of dark because it was dark in there, but, um, it's just pictures of her skating inside another recycled envelope. And I just um, made some washi tape flag on a paper clip right there. Um, another one of my um, pictures of me and my daughter while we were there um, using my photo booth app. And here's another picture of her. Um, this is just shows the flyer for the school event right there. So this just kind of holds it closed. You can go see daddy then. Okay. Um, day 23, nothing exciting. Um, just a shopping trip to the to Walmart just to get a few things. Um, day 24, this is um, a day that uh, my son came with me and we went to um, our neighborhood food bank and this is just a picture of us waiting in the car um, some journaling and then just another picture day 25 is just a picture um, we're talking about one of my one of my um, new favorite movies called The Vow and um, so I just have a picture of me laying on the couch those are my Hello Kitty pajamas and then a couple of pictures of from the movie and some journaling Day 26, this is just um, a picture. Um, my daughter's wearing one of her new favorite shirts. So she's just showing it off right there. And then here's her hugging the little teddy bear she got when she got her hair cut. It's one of her new favorite little um, stuffed animals to play with. Um, this is day 27. Uh, my daughter um, Cassidy got invited to a birthday party that um, started at her friend's house and ended at a secret location which um, ended up at Pump It Up. So um, we got to go to Pump It Up for free and my three-year-old got to go for the first time and she, her favorite thing was the large slide. Oh my gosh, she had a blast. And my son, um, Sam, he even got to go. So they had a free you know, fun weekend. So I was no. really happy about that. And thanks to Natalie for her birthday party. Um, day 28 was just uh, a lazy Sunday watching football. And all of us pretty much 
staying in our jammies all day. So that was just a little lazy day. So that's why I la labeled it Lazy Football Days. <laughs> um, day 29, I could not remember what happened that day. I don't think anything happened that day. So I just skipped to day 30, which is um, my son had pre-ordered months ago um, the new Assassin's Creed 3 video game. And he, ever since November, or sorry, October started, he was counting down the weeks, counting down the days, you know, everything. So this is just um, right after we went to go pick it up on the 30th, and he was just totally, completely thrilled. This is him playing the game. And then on the inside, um, this is one of the um, little envelopes that you sometimes get at GameStop um, with games that don't have boxes. Um, I just use that for a pocket. And then I have this favorite, um, eight favorite things that I'm going to have him fill out um, about his favorite things about this game and this day. And my last page is Happy Halloween, uh, October 31st. Um, I found this little um, vintage photo album um, piece of paper on a 12 by 12 paper that I have in my um, stash and um, I decided to use it to make a little album of Halloween. So this little pumpkin picture is just something I got off Google and printed out and this um, I ended up just um, using this for like an album cover and I poked holes and um, just added some ribbon and added some um, white cardstock inside and some dark cardstock on the outside to complete the back cover. Um, the inside, really quick, it just shows what we had for dinner. We had a jack-o'-lantern pizza from uh, Papa Murphy's. And this is just pictures from Halloween. These are all just pictures from Halloween. Um, I don't know if you really want me to go through all of them. Um, let's see. Um, I read that one. Um, this is, says, Ashlyn is dressed and ready for trick-or-treating, my little Minnie Mouse. Um, this one says, um, here is Cassidy, all dressed and spooky. My little phantom is ready to collect the candy. Um, before going trick-or-treating, we stopped at Grandma and Grandpa's house. Here is Ashlyn and Grandpa. It says, dressed up for Halloween, Ashlyn as Minnie Mouse, Cassidy as a Phantom, and BJ as the Mad Hatter. Um, so our first house, our next-door neighbor, Betty, they're so excited. Um, this one just says, the kids enjoying the night, ringing doorbells, and collecting goodies. Um, this is Ashlyn, Minnie Mouse, and her bucket of yummies. Um, this one says, my phantom and Minnie Mouse after a long walk in the neighborhood. Um, this one says, Three witches ready for round two around the neighborhood. And the last picture just says enjoying the candy. So that's just um, my little Halloween mini. Um, I saved this, I made a little pocket on the bottom here using some vellum and some washi tape. And um, so my little um, album just fits in here. And that's the last day of October. So hope you enjoyed. I'm sorry it was a really long video, but going through the whole month takes a long time. Um, so leave your comments and um, look forward to showing you my November album when it's done. And have a great night. Bye.